Hi everyone, this video is dedicated to our new tool Swapface AI and that is extremely easy to use and access because you do not need any ChatGPT subscriptions. You just need to go to our website which is copilot.us and then click on the dashboard button and you're going to be redirected to the page with the list of all the useful tools and apps that we've created so far. Just scroll down and double check if there is something else that you might be interested in. Also on the top there are different filters for the sections that you might be interested in. However, today we are talking about Swapface AI, as you can see here. Once you see that, just click on open app button and you're gonna be redirected to the app itself. So we are getting started to transform the images in the way we want. The first thing that we need to acknowledge, there are two sections, so we're gonna work with two images. First of all, we are able to upload the images either from our desktop or copy and paste in the link to the image, whatever works better for you. And another thing that we need to talk through that there is a base image or source image and the target image. So since we are working with a face swap, the base image is basically the image from which we are taking all the features from, the features of the face. And the target image is the image which will be based on everything else. So the surroundings, the outfit, and so on and so on. So. Let's jump right into the example so you understand it better. Click on the Im upload image, choose the image that you want to work with. In my case, that is random images that I've just served on the internet. Once those are plotted, just click on swap face now. And in a few moments to the right of our screen, we're gonna see the results that we are getting from this particular swap. So as you can see here, the first image was Angelina Jolie, so the features were taken from Angelina Jolie picture. However, the second image was Angela Merkel, and the rest of the image was based on Angela Merkel reference, basically the outfit, and so on and so on. Once you are done with your image swap, you can hover over the image and see that there are two options to proceed. You can either copy the link to the image or download it and make sure that you are able to use this in the future. Let's refresh the page and just make sure that we are uploading the images in another order so you understand the difference between the target and the base image. As you can see here again, in a few moments we are uploaded. So as you can see here, this time I'm uploading the Angela Merkel image as the first reference and then Angelina Jolie as the second reference. Once I'm ready, I click on swap face now button and in a few moments, we're gonna receive again the result that is based on those two images, but they will be completely different because we changed the order of our references. As you can see here, the target image was taken everything, the outfit that surrounds from Angelina Jolie image and base image from Angela Merkel face features. So we have two pictures, but we changed the order of our uploads and that is completely different result. I really hope this is very easy for you to follow. In case you have any problems whatsoever, feel free to contact our support team. They're always there to make sure that your experience is as smooth as possible. And also we have a new thing where you can upload the desired feature or even the tool. There will be the link to the form in the description box below and our technical team will be on it. Thank you for watching. Have a great day. Bye bye guys.